Yo, what's going on, everyone? Woo! Man, it is scorcher. Hot, hot, hot. So we've been fishing these Tuesday nighters um, on the river here. Kind of feeds into the Mississippi. It's garbage. Um, it's a lot of fun, though, because we usually get about 10 boats. Just a bunch of really good dudes. It's just a fish. And uh, we've won two of the last three tournaments out there. It's been a freaking grind. It's only taken one fish to uh, to win or cash a check. So this past Tuesday, uh, Buddy and I did some pre-fishing on Sunday. We caught a couple largemouth in an area that was pretty far away. Uh, we had to make a really long run. Um, for this area, it's a really long run. And uh, we had to keep watching the water levels because they were dropping. And they were dropping pretty good. So I watched them and I was like, man, we could probably gamble, make it up there, fish some areas before we get stranded with the low water. Uh, so we made the long run, got up there, didn't catch crap in our initial starting spot. So we kind of hopped around, fishing some main river stuff, some creeks that we could find that weren't uh, either blown out dirty or uh, had people fishing in it, just bank fishermen or whatever, because um, this is pretty much like downtown. This is like in a populated area of St. Louis, so there's always people there. So we got there, didn't catch anything, we hopped around and didn't catch anything. So we went back to our initial starting spot, and I ended up hooking up on two right away, um, both just small, largemouth. But for that river, it doesn't really matter as long as they're 12 inches or bigger. It's a keeper, so. I had one that was like a pound 75 and the other one was just a squeaker which i didn't weigh in because he was 12 inches but we just didn't weigh him uh and everything really has been coming off which is crazy winning a tournament on the bfs ride this is the sierra 700 uh, bfs four pound usury hybrid i'm throwing it with the daiwa pixie pixilla og pixie this is a 571 gear ratio and I was throwing my custom um, 0.5 DDs. I lost one um, that got snagged up, so I broke it off. And I've got a couple more that I've got, and I got to order a bunch more. Um, but just a great bait right here. 0.5 DDs, catching a bunch. Um, this is just in a sexy shag color, black eyes. Um, just trying to just match the hatch. The river's got a bunch of like. It looks like it's juvenile or fry of uh, Asian carp, um, the big head, jump in carp, all that kind of stuff, the invasive stuff, and maybe uh, shad fries. Um, but we caught a bunch of white bass too, just trying to find some current and where the clean water met the dirty water. But, you know, it was pretty fun. I, I got hooked up on two of the fish. They both jumped sky high, and I thought they were smallmouth possibly because just the way they were jumping. Uh, my buddy had to scramble get the net because just because it's four pound line. Um, I didn't want to boat flip them and with this rod It's uh, pretty tough to boat flip anything even at that small of a fish um, so we played it safe and uh, Just netted them up threw them in a live well, and then we made the long run back uh, Fished another creek or two and just uh, just tried to catch some fish and we ended up winning that tournament which was cool. It was fun. It was a great time. It was miserable. It's hot. I mean, we're supposed to be in the mid to upper 90s the next seven days. Um, probably won't be fishing those Tuesday nighters because the water's dropping out. Um, it's going to be bone dry here, so it's going to turn into a creek. Um, other than that, uh, just banging out reels. Just did about 25 reels, 40 baits. So just trying to stay busy in this kind of summer lull because a lot of guys aren't fishing or they're fishing very little just because it's so hot. Um, other than that, smash that thumbs up, guys. Post down below. Pretty awesome winning on with the BFS setup uh, that I helped design. A bait that I custom painted and just, you know, reels I tune myself. So pretty awesome. Smash that thumbs up, guys. We'll talk to you guys later and peace.